Discovering morning, discovering sun, discovering there's room for everyone. Discovering horses and giraffes too. Discovering me and discovering you. We're little people with great big plans. Little people, we've got helping hands. Little people, we come from one to ten. Little people, and we'll always be friends. Discovering Michael and his friend Maggie. Discovering Lion and Sonja Lee. Discovering Sarah and her twin Eddie. Discovering you and discovering me. Discovering you and discovering me. Discovering Sonia, who's gentle and true. She's kind to people and animals too. Discovering Sonia and me and you. It was a new day of discovery for the little people as they took a trip to the zoo. But wait a second, there seems to be something wrong with the animals. The giraffe. Mm -hmm. The sea lion. Over here! The elephant. Come over here! We're just not themselves. The animals, said the zookeeper, have never behaved like this before. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I think I've got an idea. Okay. And he certainly did. The little people are making a giraffe just as tall as the real one. No, no, not you, Eddie. Sonia should be on top, if she dares. Come on, Sonia. Now they can talk to the giraffe. The giraffe told Sonia that the animals were sad today because they're bored. But the little people have a perfect answer for that. They have a plan to cheer the animals up a bit. Hooray! A train ride! But where are the little people taking the animals? They're taking them to school. Today, you're going to watch us instead of the other way round. A, B, C, D, E, Sarah and Michael are practicing the alphabet. Sonia and Eddie are practicing in the gym. Whee! Come on, Sonia. You can do it. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah. Join us, guys! I mean, animals! And so they did. Come on, let's play!
The little people brought the animals back to the zookeeper in high spirits. agreed to visit each other as often as they could. Are discovering what fun it is to play in newly fallen snow. Hello, Mother Bear. Perfect. Good day, sir. Here we go! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh. Hey! Is everything is okay? okay? Oh, Freddy? 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 Are you okay? Freddy? Are you... That was fun! I like having a lot of snow to play in. <laughs> Quiet seal and monkey! <laughs> Seal? Monkey, what's the matter? <laughs> what is it, Sonia? What did they say? The zoo wasn't ready for so much snow. They need our help. What are we waiting for? Let's go! <laughs> We just can't keep up with all the snow. Nowhere to hide from the snow in there. What will we do? Where can they go? Keeping animals warm is what barns are for. Do you think that will be okay with Farmer Jed? Why, sure. There's room for everyone inside my barn. Come on in. We'll all be cozy as cozy can be in here. There, there. No need for anyone to be nervous. Soon as I get some more hay down here, we'll all be snug as a bug in a rug. <laughs> Say, with all this help, this is going to be a piece of cake. <laughs> Never saw anyone miss the floor before. There you are, Mrs. Cow. <laughs> Farmer Jed, why do you have that old chair out here? Oh, I like to come out here every night and share a story with my animals. It makes for a nice time of sharing. Oh, I like that. Can I tell the animals a story? Well, now, that's a good idea. You know, we should do this every year, snow or no snow. It's great when doing a good deed helps us discover something really nice. Twas the night before Christmas, and all through the barn, all the creatures were happy and doing no harm. While outside the snow gusted and swirled, inside of the barn, all was right with the world. And as the new friends snuggled in for the night, they wished each one peace as they turned out the light. And so, the little people discovered that a good deed and good friends make any night a special one.
Discovering Sonia Who's gentle and true She's kind to people And animals too Discovering Sonia And me and you Happy birthday to Zoo! <laughs> Birthdays are special days and sometimes they're filled with special surprises. Really? Wow, that's great! What'd they say? The giraffe said, the tiger said, the panda said, that the lion said he heard from the seal that the monkey told him... <gasps> it's the zookeeper's Day. They want to surprise him with a present. That's a great idea. What kind of present? A banana? Fish? Nice, a basket of peanuts. Bamboo shoots? And tree leaves. Those are wonderful. But perhaps he'd like a cake, too? They love the idea. Well, I'm going to lunch. See you later. Goodbye. Don't hurry back. <laughs> Now's our chance to get his cake. Come on, before he gets back. And so the animals and all their friends went to get a birthday cake to surprise the zookeeper. But when they got to the bakery, they got a surprise. The baker was all out of cakes. Oh, dear. Then they got another surprise. Uh, he, he always stops by after lunch for dessert. He'll be here any minute. Any minute? Oh, no. Can you bake him a cake before he gets here? Uh, I, I think so. We can all help. Well, as I always say, the cake bakes quicker with helping hands. Uh, and paws. <laughs> <laughs> Is Zookeeper coming yet? Not yet. What is that? Oh, dear. I... I guess we must have jumped around too much. Poor Zookeeper. His present is flat as a pancake. Or flat as... a cookie. Uh-oh. Hurry! Here he comes! <laughs> Hello? Happy birthday! My goodness. The animals made a surprise for your birthday. Uh -huh. We helped! But just a little. <laughs> a banana cookie, thank you! <laughs> well, that's wonderful, a fish cookie! <laughs> oh my, would you look... Well, that's very nice! <laughs> thank you all. You've made this the... the best birthday ever. And so the animals learned that the best presents of all are the ones that come from the heart. Discovering Sonia, who's gentle and true. She's kind to people and animals too. Discovering Sonia and me and you. Sonia Lee and the Super Sunday. 
It's a great day to build something. Something big. This is gonna be a great sandbox. All we need now is the sand. Where's Sonia Lee? She's bringing it. Here we come. With the most important part of the sandbox, the sand. Are you ready? Whoa! Not so fast! No, no, that's too much! Our sandbox is buried! He only wanted to help. Now he feels bad. With all this sand, we can just, um, build two sandboxes. Do you think you can talk to him? Make him feel better? I'll try. Hello, everyone. Hi, Farmer Jed. I have a little problem at the farm. Sure could use some help. Sure, Farmer Jed, let's go. I'll catch up with you guys later. Okay, see you at the farm. Where'd all the snow come from? A little snowstorm that lost its way. The cows Ooh. talked into leaving them with some snow to play with. <laughs> cows. That doesn't seem like much of a problem to me. Yeah, it looks like fun. That's not the problem. That's the problem. It's frozen. Yup, the cows jumped around in the snow so much, <laughs> their milk turned to ice cream. Wow, there's enough here for the whole town. Maggie's right. The problem is, I can't take it there. My tractor won't make it, the snow's too deep. There's nothing with big enough wheels to get through. Here's something big enough to get through. Go ahead, you can do it. Everybody, help us eat the world's biggest ice cream sundae. Here you go. You did a great job. No matter who you are, there will always be a way that you can help your friends. Discovering morning, discovering sun, discovering there's room for everyone. Discovering horses and giraffes too, discovering me and discovering you. We're little people with great big plans, little people we've got helping hands. Little people, we count from one to ten. Little people, and we'll always be friends. Discovering Michael and his friend Maggie. 
discovering lion and Sonya Lee, discovering Sarah and her twin Eddie, discovering you and discovering me. 